hi uh, in this video i will show you how to set up aws s3 and simple and rest api endpoints with the help of nocoreapi.com so click on the set up this api and we will go over here so click on this button set up this api and this will get you on the dashboard of nocoreapi.com go to the marketplace find s3 click on this button and click on this button make aws s3 api and just give a name aws s3 rest endpoint and you have to give uh, access key id and secret access key ID. you can get it from your aws console dot aws dot amazon dot com and then you have to go uh, to over here my security credentials and you have to click on this button access keys you have you can only make maximum two access keys so click on this button create new access key and this will give create you a access key id and secret key so you can click on this button this will show you the access key id and secret access key so copy this access key id paste it over here and copy your secret key id paste it over here and just give a name something aws s3 rest api and click on this button create so now your aws s3 rest api endpoint is easy so you can use this endpoint to list your content so if you click on this button use this api this will list you all the endpoint we have uh, we have a list buckets list bucket object get object put object and upload remote file so you can also upload remote file if you have something uh, image file a pdf file you can easily upload your remote file with this endpoint and put the bucket name url and file name if you want to give and the acs now you can also test these endpoint with our playground if you click on this open playground this will give you all the endpoints we have you can list your bucket write it out and execute so this will return you the buckets you have uh, number one bucket number two bucket and uh, you copy this bucket id and you can also list the bucket object by bucket name and execute so you will get all the objects keys and data with this help also get the single object and you can put a remote or put an object try it out if we give a bucket name is our for api and if we choose a file let's suppose something called drive.png and execute this so this will give you this response and give you the location as well as you can access these by these locations and you can also upload a remote file like give a bucket name first of all and if you have something called uh, like movies posters like suppose this one and if we you got this url that this is the url and you post the url and execute this so if you if you do that then you are pushing the remote files on your package and after that you will got the result and this is your file this is your file on your aws clients so yeah this is cool so just try it out this aws s3 simple endpoint with the help of nocodeapi.com